my beautifuls, it's me Alyssa. So today I have my January 2015 Ipsy bag for you all. I'm so excited, I'm sorry I've been away. There will be a video of me talking about where I've been. I just have not been feeling well lately and I know that's a really, I, don't, I know that's not an excuse or anything, but I've just been really not feeling well to the point where I couldn't get out of bed. So I'm really sorry for the lack of videos and that every time I come back it's usually some kind of ipsy opening. But um, I will get back to making videos soon. I am working on my other channels that I do own because I do own several other channels. Um, so just bear with me. There will be an update video if, if you have questions or anything. So I'm going to get started with opening the January 2015 um, Ipsy bag, which I got in the mail, I think, maybe like two days ago. So I'm really excited to open it because I got some pretty good things in my Ipsy bag. So I'm really excited and yeah, we're going to get started. So the theme for January is Fresh Start because it's a new year. So this is just the card of what it looks like. It just says Fresh Start. So that's the card. And then here is the bag, which is pretty simple. Um, very nice material. Um, it's kind of like, it's one of those, like, wipeable materials. Um, it's like this kind of checkered, um, kind of wickery, wickered basket type of looking pattern. Um, so it's blue on the front, like a royal blue. And then this cream white on the back. And then it has a kind of peachy orange zipper. So that's what the bag looks like. Pretty nice um, quality bag. You know, I just store little things in here and I use it. I use them a lot. So they're pretty, they come in pretty good handy for me. <laughs> so we're going to get started with what I got in the bag. So first I got the Ma Malin Plus Goetz Mojito Lip Balm. This is a daily protection and soothing treatment. So it's basically like a lip balm. So I really need lip balms like this because I don't know. It smells kind of minty. I don't know. I don't know. It smells kind of minty to me. Um, but I do have really chapped, bad lips. <laughs> you can't see it under my lipstick. Um, but it they look crappy and awful. So I always have to put something on them. So um, this should be really nice to try because I do like using lip balms and trying new ones out to see which will moisturize my lips better so that comes in really good handy for me so I'm really excited with that the next thing is this lash food serum this is a natural eyelash enhancing system and it's eco-friendly I'm always up for you know natural products because they're better for you so this is just what it looks like um, Here's just what it comes like in. And then here's what it looks like. I'm not going to open it yet. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to use it yet because I, I I, can't even get through mascara at the moment. <laughs> I have so many little samples I need to finish up. But this will be really nice to try. Hopefully, you know, it, you know, my my eyes just Says see stronger, thicker, longer lashes in just four weeks. The probably that's probably needed for my lashes because they're always falling out and they're always bothering me. So I can't wait to try that out. Hopefully it works very well. And then next is a Pacifica eyeshadow. This is a natural mineral coconut eyeshadow. I think the colors. I think the color is coconut. I don't know. Why must they make packaging so hard to open? I'm opening this stuff for the first time. Usually I already have it open by now. But I've been waiting for this video. So, here to open this. And they're cruelty free. Pacifica is a cruelty free um, makeup line. All right, so I got that out. This is in the color Easy Thrill, and it's Pacifica Natural Beauty. So it's really like this natural. Here's what the package, packaging looks like. It's this 
Ooh, is that a pretty color? It's a very kind of neutral light color. I don't even know how to describe this. But it's very natural. It's a very natural looking color. It's kind of, I guess, somewhere like in the taupe family. But it's very light and very soft. You know, it's just like a very nice, you know, light kind of enhancing color. Um, probably great for the bra bone. Um, probably will look great with like a like a cream cream a cream base to you know bring out this eyeshadow color a little bit more. Um, so I think this would be really cute, a uh, really nice eyeshadow. You know, maybe wear it in the spring, just to, something just to brighten the eyes up. If you're not wanting to go full on, you know, in depth with your makeup that day, that'd be pretty nice and cool. So I really do like it, and Pacifica is a really pretty good brand. So I don't, I I really do like trying their stuff. So I. I'm pretty excited for that. And then next is a nail polish, which I really don't need more nail polish, so I'm probably not going to keep this. And plus I already have a color like this. This is from Pro Bell. This is a nail polish in Into the Blue. I don't know. It's, it's like... It's a bit lighter than what the bag looks like. Um, I guess it's like a mid-tone blue. But I already have a color that looks like this, and I have too many nail polishes already, so I'm probably going to save this and give this as a gift, because I already have so many. But the color looks beautiful, but I already have too many nail polishes, and I shouldn't be buying any more, or using, I should use what I have, because I use the same colors over and over again. So I'm probably going to pass it on to somebody, because I already have it. Um... Next is this thing I really, really like. So this is by Elizabeth Moth. This is their All Over Shadow Brush, and it's in pink. Oh my gosh. I don't have to paint my brushes anymore. Because I used to just take nail polish and paint them pink because I couldn't find any, you know, colored ones. And those are expensive, you know, just to buy something that's colorful, like at Sephora, like those colored sets that they have, the travel ones. But this is adorable. It's this really nice neon pink. Oh, and the bristles are super, super soft. Oh my gosh. I love this brush already. This is, I can't wait to try this out. But here's what it looks like. This is a nice bright neon pink, which is my favorite color. And the bristles on this are so soft compared to other brushes I use. They're not as soft as this. It's like, it's like, oh my gosh. It's so soft. I like it. So I'm really impressed with this brush, and I cannot wait to use it because it's pink, and I love it. And Elizabeth Mott actually is a pretty good makeup brand. Um, I do have one of their eyeshadows. So they do have some pretty good things. I would probably recommend checking them out because they have some pretty good things um, of their products. So I really, really like this brush. And that is um, the end of my Ipsy bag. So I am pretty excited for most of these products. Um, I'm pretty, I'm pretty much excited for everything except for the nail polish because I have too many already. So I'll either pass it on to my mom or give it as a gift to somebody. But overall, everything is pretty good. I can't wait to try it. Um, I would say this was a really great way to start off 2015 for Ipsy. At least for what I got. Um, you can, I'm sure other people got different things, but I'm pretty ex excited I, that I got this stuff. So it's a great way to start off um, 2015 for Ipsy for me. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Um, if you have any video requests, let me know in the comments. And I will let you guys know and get back to you guys on it. So thank you guys so much for watching again. And have a beautiful and magical day. I'll see you guys in my next video. Love you all. Bye.